One of the main advantages of our palladium tank plating kit is that it has a similar brightness to rhodium, but unlike rhodium it can be shipped outside the EU and the UK. It's also a good choice if you need to immersion plate items that feature materials such as pearl or coral, as our palladium tank plating solution will not etch materials made from calcium carbonate. In this demonstration, we'll be showing you how to use this kit using this pearl pendant. For step-by-step -step guidance on how to set up your palladium tank plating kit, please follow the instructions for setting up our rhodium tank plating kit, which you can find in our electroplating manual under the tank plating category. Heat the solution to between 48 to 52 degrees centigrade and set the stir to very low with the mini stirring bar in the palladium tank plating solution. After setting up your palladium tank plating kit, you'll need to work out how long to plate to achieve your desired thickness of palladium. To do this, please go to our palladium tank plating calculator and enter in the necessary information. The calculator includes a section where you can enter in the actual pH of your solution. We advise checking and if necessary adjusting the pH of your palladium tank plating solution on a regular basis. For guidance on this, please see the relevant section in our electroplating manual. We pH tested the palladium tank plating solution that was used for this demonstration and it had a pH of 7.2, which is well within the optimal operating pH range for palladium tank plating solution, so no palladium pH adjuster was added. The required thickness of plate that was entered was 0.5 microns, as anything over this may require manual polishing. The volume of the tank is 250 mil, and once all of this is entered, up come your required settings. The amps need to be set to 0.04, the time will be set to 2 minutes and 56 seconds, and the volume of palladium replenisher that will need to be added the next time the solution is used is 0.12 mil. Once you have set up your equipment, the piece you intend to plate will need to be cleaned. First clean with MPU and then power clean using our cleaner. This is a good choice for cleaning in this situation as the item is hollow and the cleaner can clean inside the cavity very effectively. Once cleaned, rinse in the two rinse beakers and fix it to the gold plated jigging wire above the palladium plating tank. Lower your work into the tank and switch on the tank plating rectifier. Set the plating timer to the right time and once the time's up, switch off the tank plating rectifier, remove your work from the plating beaker and pass it through the two rinse beakers. All of the equipment and solutions used in this demonstration can be purchased from our online shop at www.golden.co.uk